Hi, and welcome back to JohnTruck.com. This week we wanted to talk about like some of the things that the Amish are wrong on, why the Amish are wrong. We hate to con be condescending towards them or nitpicky or anything, but we've got some, there's some things that are wrong about the, the way the Amish believe, and obviously, well, you know that I'm not Amish anymore, and so I obviously believe that, and, and I, I am thankful for the fact that I have left the Amish and then was able to see the truth because one of the big reasons that, that they believe wrongly is because they believe that you shouldn't do Bible studies, you shouldn't, you certain, shouldn't, shouldn't search the scriptures to find out what actual truth is, um, because if you do, you might go astray. Well, I wonder why that is. It's probably because the Bible actually doesn't say that you need to live Amish, that you need to be like that. So that's why they go astray, along with the fact that they read a German Bible. They don't even, they speak Pennsylvania Dutch and they know a little German and then they read the German Bible so they're reading their Bible in a language that they don't really even understand so then they also caution not using the English Bible because that could make you go astray. Again it's because as you read the English Bible as you, as you, you can see that the way the Amish teach is wrong. But what's the major thing that they're wrong on or the important thing that or the thing that they're wrong on that's the most important, and that's obviously is salvation. We see uh, in, let's say, John 3, 16, where it says, basically it talks about having everlasting life. It talks about having everlasting life, and the verse I was thinking of is John 3, 36, as well, where it says, He that hath the Son hath life, he that hath not the Son hath not life. And there's several other verses where it says, hath, that's referring to having it now, having eternal life now knowing or in first John 5 13 where it says you can know so, so that you may know that you have eternal life all these verses the Amish would say no that's not true you can't know yeah they will say okay you have to know or, or you have to be quote unquote saved what they call saved but you have to keep yourself saved you have to to stay saved and you have to keep doing good well the, the Bible teaches us opposite obviously it teaches us that um, that when that Jesus Christ died for our sins, in which they believe too, so the, the, they're the same here. But where they where they start going wrong is they say, well, it's Jesus Christ plus your goodness. Well, the Bible clearly says not of works, lest any man should boast. In Ephesians two eight and nine, um, so so we can see by reading the Bible that the Amish are wrong in this. And so it comes down to um, John three. 17 and 18 it says that he that hath not the son is condemned already and we we don't like saying that i don't like saying that about the amish that they're condemned to hell i i wish such weren't the case but it the bible says it is and i can't argue the bible god is the one who wrote the bible and so i need to listen to the bible well with that that is the reason that i'm obviously wanting to witness to them trying to reach out to them so to show them what really truly means to be saved and trusting Christ for that. If you don't fully understand what I'm referring to as far as trusting Christ, you can go ahead and, and check our Where Is Your Path Leading You on our on our website. Um, it's got a pretty solid path as far as to what I'm talking about on there. Um, or you can contact us as well. Um, and it, would you please be praying for my family um, as far as them not being saved and other Amish as well and, and if you have the opportunity to do so would you tell them about Christ as well so that they don't have to be condemned to everlasting hell please click the link below for further information on what we talked about today and you have any questions comment below like and subscribe and we'll see you back next week johnschrock.com signing off I left